Go check out IGSky.com. If you look at the cheap Ultimate Team coins, they've got a fully automated service. You get your coins instantly. Use the discount code Rossi for that extra 5% off. Go do it right now. Enjoy the video. Hello guys, Mr. Rossi1990 here, and I am back on my channel with a new series. No, this isn't the random hybrid, which is obviously my main series on my channel, but I thought it would be nice to have like a second main series. I've got the Diamond Effect, which is kind of a little bit of a series, but I kind of uh, just randomly put that out. It's not like a set thing. Diamond Effect is like daily or every other day, but I would like to have something different so potential viewers can have an option instead of having the same videos in their sub box every day. I understand a lot of people do like the random hybrid, but there is a majority of people who may not like the random hybrid hybrid and I've got to kind of reach out to them people as well it's only fair that's why I do YouTube to kind of please everybody and uh, all have a good time now this series is a series which I'm gonna love now there's a lot of these already on YouTube so I'm not saying I'm the first person to ever do this I'm definitely not uh, but I love it I love watching the videos who do these the people who do these types of videos I love well there's two things I love in FIFA and that's opening packs and being first owner when you pack a big player. You know, like, you know that feeling you get when you pack a good player and he's yours, he's fresh, he's first owner. And um, there's a couple of series like this. It's basically just going to be a road to glory with packs. Literally just that. Now, the series I've seen recently, it's kind of similar in a sense to Pack Gods by Nick28T. He's done that for a little bit. He's one of my favorite people in general really going with Nick and um, he's a good streamer if you don't know who he is you probably do by now he's just 100k subs actually fair play to him and um, there's other people as well I think Fuji is a really good YouTuber as well he does a similar series as well but um, they're all different because they're all different in what you get in your packs so it can never really be the same I've wanted to do a road to glory for a long time now and I thought I could make this the best of both worlds I can open my packs get my first owner hype and then do a road to glory at the same time. So hopefully you guys can appreciate this. Like I said, I understand that it's not going to be new to you. You would have seen this on every other YouTube channel. Not everyone's, but most people's. And um, it's a good series. I, I feel as if we have a little bit of fun with it. But I'm going to start off with opening 10 packs. Uh, I've chucked a load of coins on this account from another account. It's a fresh account as well. I've got, you know, no games played on here. So um, we're just going to open 10 packs live. And it's all going to come up with news. And, oh, you've never opened a pack before. How the hell do you do this? But hopefully you can get some average players. And then as time goes on... Obviously, we'll open more and more packs. We started off with Peter Crouch, lads. I'm going to let you everything as you can see. First, everything here. I forgot what we've got to do here. Just Let's just skip this because nobody ain't got time for that. We've got Mason in there. So, we've got manager. But contracts and all that is going to come in handy. So, I'm just going to store all that in my club. Um, I'll get on to the rules as we go of, of how I get packs and how things progress. But that's our first pack. We'll go into our second pack. It'll all be live. The gameplay will be live. Ideally, it'll be face cam soon as well. I'm just sorting out a camera and a new mic because my mic's pretty shocking. But we've got Smalling. So it's looking so far like we're going down the Premier League kind of route. But um, we got a pacey bastard there. That's decent. We like the pace. Chemistry on the first couple of games may not be, you know, everything. Uh, we'll just go from that. But ideally, we're going to try and win Division 1. That is the aim of the series. And as you guys are probably aware from my random hybrid series i'm probably not the best fifa player out there i'm actually not that great at all that guy is uh supporting movember my god we've got the badge there as well but i'm rocking the plum fire guard badge at the minute and i enjoyed that one so that was pack three pack four going into now just, just 10 packs to get us started and um then it will become more difficult kind of to get packs on the way but again another premier league player john obi Mikel, also got a english premier league manager there so that's decent for upping chemistry you know if we haven't got the best chemistry going on in the world but i think this is pack number five i always lose count but it's never bad opening an extra packet we're gonna skip this one and it was a bad move we've got pellegrini there oh five thousand coins that's always nice you can never really say bad word about five thousand coins you basically get that pack for free or you pay like two thousand coins for the pack but i imagine if i sold the players then uh, we probably get our money back if not you know, a decent little profit. But this is pack number six, I think, or seven. We've got the Torres. He's actually not bad on this game. I've used him multiple times before, and I don't mind him at all. I feel as if he's decent. He gets a lot of slate in real life for being average or really poor and missing open goals and all that. But on FIFA, he's okay. This is pack number seven. We're going to skip it. We've got Huddlestone again, another Premier League player. So it is looking likely that we're going down the Premier League route. We'll just discard that guy because I can't imagine he sells for anything. But pack number eight we're going into now. If I've got it wrong, by the way, and I've not packed, not um, done my packs right, um, then let me know in the comment section below because my counting skills is average. I've got Luke Shaw. That's good. Also got the Marcus Beasley. That's a nice little first owner player there. He's probably difficult to pack if you open goal packs all the time. Squad fitnesses will come in massive handy. Massive handy. This doesn't sound right when I say it. But I think this is pack number nine. But again, I might have got it wrong. with the skip this one again. LSU. Decent. 
decent indeed. Now, I can sell stuff. That's not a problem. So if we want to get coins um, from selling things, then we can do that. I'll just see if he sells for 350. If not, then we just discard him. But this is going to be the final pack. We're going to do this, and then we're going to have a look what we got in the team. There won't be any gameplay in this episode, but ideally there will be games. I'll explain to you how I get my packs. But we've got ourselves a good goalkeeper. Now, that's a good solid thing to get because normally you, you open these packs you're like shit i haven't even got a goalkeeper uh, well i do anyway so um that's nice so we've got a goalkeeper so there's our 10 packs done i think i think like i said we can loan players as well this is the team i've got rocking at the moment i had to play uh, a game against the um computer just to get some coins to transfer over some coins and this guy ended up scoring nine in one game i played it on beginner not gonna lie to you and um, it was very poor but we're just gonna clear these players out of my club and then we can literally start from fresh but everything's gonna be first owner the idea of the series like i said is to reach division one let me know in the comment section below of any you know things you would like to add to the series also can anybody think of a name for the series now i was thinking of the likes of like the only way is pack but that kind of sounds gay it sounds like the only way is essex i thought about that afterwards it's probably not the best idea um if you've got any ideas of a name that brilliant to see in the comment section below also any rules like i just said but the idea of the series is i play a game if i win i get a pack if I score a hat trick of a player, I get a pack, etc., etc., etc. It will come into effect as we go along. If we lose a game, we have to open a bronze pack, etc., draw a game, silver pack. We'll all be in divisions, ideally, unless we want to play like a fitness game, something along those lines, just to go for that. But we're going to have a quick look at what we got on my club. Who's the highest rate player I got in that little 10 packs? It was, in fact, Rene Adler. Um, so let's have a look what kind of players we want to do. We want to. Well, we really badly want to start with the smalling at the back and then the ultimate link with Luke Shaw. We can almost go ahead and make a hybrid ourselves here. Rene Adler is going to be our goalkeeper. Well, we did actually get another goalkeeper. So that's pretty decent. What other centre-backs did we get here? We did not get very good centre-backs. Um, this guy looks all right. I don't think we got him. I think he probably was in the starter pack, wasn't he? Um, yikes, not great. What right-backs have we got? We've got Mandy here, who uh, definitely came in my starter pack. I remember him. But what else have we got here? John Obi Mikel. Actually, no, 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 no. We'll leave him there a second. Tom Huddlestone. We're going to rock in the center mid here. Now, we're, gonna, we're actually going to go with Crouch up front, lads. But unbelievably, we're going to go with the Crouch Torres combination up front to start us off in this series. That just doesn't sound good, does it? We may have to go with that guy in left mid. I'm going to rock the 4 4 2 for a minute because I feel as if it's a standard formation. It's very OP in like certain areas. Um, ooh, we could go down. Oh, Canales. I like Canales. Um. 4-1-2-1-2 could be an option if Canales is is happening. And, of course, he links with Torres as well. Actually, that isn't a bad thing. Canales. I'm thinking 4 one 2 one 2 actually, guys, because then we can rock Huddlestone in CDM. We could even do that. Yeah, we're going to do this. We are going to do this. Canales is going to go cam. Crouch is not going to get the full chemistry, but... It's not going to be any good anyway, is he? Um, do we get... Oh, we got this guy. That's good. That's very good. I don't think he's very good, actually. What's he like? He's okay. And then we can rock in the CDM position. We obviously got John Obi Mikel, um, which we are going to put there, in fact. We're going to have John Obi Mikel not at centre-back, but even though he'd probably be OP as hell there, we're going to have him there. You know, we haven't exactly got the worst chemistry in the world going on here, guys. I'm not actually that... You know, I'm pretty impressed by what's going on. But what else have we got? We've ran out of shiny players. Uh, I might rock LSU at right back because he's got that pace and just all-round awesomeness. Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to have LSU at right back. He's not going to get chemistry. He's going to get bloody borderline nothing. Um, but then, oh, centre-backs is a problem. Have we got anything else going on here? That guy's pretty good, actually. I'll be tempted to use him instead of Crouch because he's got pace. Classy, there's a good player. Um, bollocks. We need some We need some chemistry going along here. What have we got? Oh, we've got Sergio Roberto there. He's not a bad little player, actually. Um, these are the starter pack players I got. Ruben Mikel, Mandy... And that guy there, and also a silver called Sanchez, which is not bad, I suppose. You could have had worse, so I'm actually quite all right with that. We've got PC there as well. He's a good player. Um, we're going to have this guy, centre-back. It's going to have to be. He's got the most kind of like stats-wise for centre-back. But that looks like it's going to be our team to start things off on this episode. But let's fill out our bench with some uh, decent players who might actually impact us on the pitch. So this guy right here is a striker. He might do some good. What else have we got here? We have got uh, Classy. I like I like the look of this guy as an attacking kind of midfield player. We kind of need a cover for each position. Not really a goalkeeper. I'm not too bothered about that. Centre back. We will just go with this guy just in case it's going horribly wrong for the other guy. So we've got a striker. We need kind of like two strikers really. A left mid we've got. Even though we're not actually rocking the formation with a left mid. But we still he could be an option to bring on. A CDM is interesting. Javi Garcia is a good player. And um, that's not a problem at all. What else have we got going on here? That guy looks really decent 
solid, good passing. Not a problem at all. We'll take him. And one more player, maybe like an attacking player. Gabbiadini's decent. Uh, Mason. I might go... Oh, he's, he's actually really slow. He felt a lot quicker in the game I played, but like I said, I was playing on beginner. And um, it was so easy. Uh, Bizarro's a good player. Who should we have? Who shall we have here? We're just going to have... Have classy, so we got we got kind of like a jam packed midfield anyway, so that's kind of covering the midfield. So that is going to be our team, which we're going to rock into some games with. Um, like I said, this is kind of like a pilot episode. Ideally, there will be gameplay. This is just I don't want to, um, you know, spam a gameplay on top of this now because it'll be like quite a long video as it is because we kind of done it all live. We've opened the packs and we've made the team, we've kind of got going for the first episode, but it looks all right to be fair for a first kind of briefing of a game but like i said we play games we earn packs through games let me know in the comment section below of any ways you think it might be a little bit more interesting but this is just like a side series of random hybrid just so everybody gets the best of both worlds but if you have enjoyed this a like would be absolutely fantastic if we can try and nail 500 likes to the first episode that'll be absolutely brilliant i know you guys can do it also if you're new around here don't be afraid to hit that subscribe button there'll be awesome content on my channel i can guarantee you awesomeness but hopefully you had a good day random hybrid will still be out later so you're having the best of both worlds there again I'll see you next time, and bye-bye, boom.